Hello YouTube, want to do some drawings but don't have the budget to buy a Wacom tablet? Keep watching and I might just have the thing for you. Greetings everyone and welcome, Carlos here from Everything Tech. In this video, I'm unboxing, having a first look and testing, the Bamboo Stylus Fine Line. The Bamboo Stylus Fine Line is a Bluetooth smart pen that works on the iPad and the ones that I've tested, iPad Mini, iPad 3, iPad Air, iPad Air 2, iPad Pro, it doesn't work. So if you have an iPad Pro and you're in the market for a cheap stylus, don't buy this one because it's not going to work. So the um, stylus fine line has Bluetooth, it's a smart pen, it has 10,024 levels of pressure. You can capture notes and ideas and it comes all nicely packaged inside of this box. The model number for anybody that wants to know is CS600CK. It has palm rejection and has a thin tip designed for precise writing drawing and navigation and it's pressure sensitive as well so it should be a fine addition if you like drawing and you have an ipad okay so i'm really better drawing i'm telling you that from the start but i will unbox it and test it so you guys can see exactly what you get when you buy the bamboo stylus fine line okay so without further ado let's get inside the box and see what we get Okay, so the first thing to note is this little booklet with the apps that are supported. So you got the Adobe, you got some Zen brushes, uh, Note Plus, um, and plus uh, there's two apps, one for updating the pen and another one which is a drawing app by Bamboo. On this sign is saying thank you. You can download the apps from the App Store. And you also get a micro USB to full USB a cable so you can charge the stylus and manuals that nobody reads with product information and uh, warranty and here you have some more okay so let, let's have a look at the stylus now put that aside for a second so the stylus comes nicely laid out like that so that's the the cap and that is the stylus Okay, so let's insert the cap for a second and have a look around the stylus. So you have one button there, that's your connection button. Um, and there's a, a little blue LED in here which lets you know if the pen is active or if it's connected, or if it's connected to the app itself or whether the battery is low. At the top here, if you remove this cap, you see the micro USB port so you can charge the stylus. So that will go just like that and you just have to use a USB charger to charge the stylus. So I've got my iPad here. Um, let's see if we can load a couple of apps. So like the first thing that I want to draw your attention to is to update the pen itself. So when you first get it, it might not be the latest software version. So just launch your um, Wacom uh, stylus firmware update which you can get this app in the App Store. And then you choose what stylus you have. So I have the stylus fine line and click next. So prepare for the update, make sure that your stylus is charged and that the iPad's got enough charge to be on for 15 minutes. And then all you need to do is take the cap off, click on proceed, wait for the blue light. So turn on your, on your device. So click on the button blue light is on now and then connect the two dots so just draw a line across the two dots up to date so you, your stylus is already the latest firmware installed so click on done and that app is done so now we're gonna have a look at the bamboo app which is the one that comes with the, the stylus itself okay so in the app itself you have you can open up a new book so let's just make up a new book like writer 
and the cover you can choose the cover of the book in here uh, let's just just choose something um, you can choose a passcode for it and you can choose it to be read only so that's enough for me and now what you can do you can draw just like if you were drawing on paper it's just really smooth it's very different than writing on paper but it's very accurate and it has palm rejection so like if I put my hand in here I can write there without having any issues and without smudging this bit here where my hand was resting so in this first one here you can go back to the home and then here is for sharing that's for going back and you can also use the button to go back a step so say you made an eye bigger than the other eye so you can go back one step and now you can make another eye smaller uh, in here it tells you whether your stylus is, con is connected so you have the battery remaining on the stylus and the button layout so I've got it set up to undo but you can have it as an eraser if you have it as, a, as an eraser then it, all you need to do is click the button and it will delete it will be just an eraser and other features you can choose your writing posture so I prefer this one but you can choose different ones depending on your writing style so let's just move that one over to undo that's my favorite one and then in here you can choose in here you can choose the tips that you want and the thickness of the line so let's just choose crayon and when you write with a crayon it's really really accurate I really like the way that they've done this and then further in you have the eraser which if you click that button then you, you, you don't need to click uh, that button you will just erase and here so you can bookmark the drawing it's a very nice pen and it's not very expensive so it's it might be something that you want to consider before you actually buy a writing tablet uh, if you have an iPad or if you have a tablet that supports the bamboo like some Android tablets support the bamboo fine line because there are apps uh, for the um, for the app for Android so this is my unboxing first look and test of the bamboo stylus fine line hope you enjoyed this video please give me a thumbs up thank you very much for watching and i'll see you in the next one goodbye